so mostly we associate torque with rigid bodies rotating around a fixed axis with some kind of a rotational push to make the body spin now in this lesson we will define torque when it acts on a particle that moves along any trajectory relative to a fixed point and not necessarily a fixed axis also this trajectory need not be a circle anymore and it could be any path the particle takes around a point about which we are trying to find the torque and since torque is a vector it can point in any direction depending on the situation so consider this particle at point a in an xy plane and a force f that acts on the particle in the same plane which means force f is in the xy plane as well then if the particle's position can be defined by position vector r the torque that acts on the particle relative to the fixed point o will be a vector quantity that can be expressed as a cross product of r and f now we are quite familiar with how we find the direction of torque that is we slide the vector f without changing its direction until the two vectors are tail to tail and then we can make use of the right hand rule by sweeping the fingers of the right hand from r that is the first vector in this formation towards vector f that is the second vector and when you do this the thumb gives the direction of the torque 